Uh, I'm making this video for my friend Adam, who's also a fellow animated light enthusiast. Uh, he asked me to make a, a shoot a video of my mega tree before I took it down, so that's why I'm doing this. Here's the mega tree right here. It goes up. The tree itself goes up about 12 feet. And then I have the angel, and then this year I added a, a star on top. Uh, I wanted to get a little higher so that you'd be able to see it a little bit better from the freeway. Well, at least the freeway off ramp, but not necessarily the freeway. Um, I don't have uh, dirt here. My mega tree is on a driveway, so in order to um, to make a mega tree, I had to build a frame for the the pole. So what I did is I took this these two by sixes here and and made a frame for it. In the middle, I put a cross section where I built a box. And in that box is where the one inch galvanized pipe goes. And you see I put cross supports over here to hold it up straight. This works pretty well. I have no guide wires on my mega tree. The actual, the pole, this holds it up pretty good. Then the, when I put the lights on it, it doesn't really move at all. This year in the center, I put a smaller tree that goes up about halfway and then I put a medium tree that goes up about halfway so that I could make the tree look like if it was going from small, medium to large, up and down. Uh, I did that on a few sequences. Uh, those do not rotate, those two trees do not rotate. Uh, I will show you those as I take the lights out, I will show you those because I had someone else ask me to take a picture of that so I could see, so he could see how I uh, put this together. The, um, the pole is basically, it's two galvanized pipes. One is 10 foot, of course, and then I coupled with a, a piece that's about four feet. Uh, the tree only goes up another two feet, so it's about 12 feet tall. Then I attached the angel on top of that. And like I said, this year I added this additional part here so that there was a star above the angel. Inside here, I hang my, my uh, strobes. Let's see if I can show you here. And basically what I did is, you know, I take a C9 strand and then I clip the, the strand on through this so the strobes all hang down downward. Uh, I've heard people complaining a lot about their strobes needing weep holes and stuff because of moisture and condensation. Uh, so I've got all mine going down so that water really can't get into them. Alright, that's enough for now. I'll, uh, I'll take a few more shots as I'm taking it down. Here's how I hook my lights to the, top, the pole. A lot of guys have some real elaborate um, pieces that they they do that they winch up. Uh, they have hooks all around it, and you know my mega tree is not that tall. I'm able to reach the top of it by standing on top of a, an eight-foot ladder, which I'm doing right now. So what I did is I just took my galvanized pipe and I drilled four holes in it, and I put hooks in the holes, which you see right here. Um, on the back side here, on this side over here. Is it that side right there. Um, I have three of the uh, white wedges and then and, and two of the uh, blue, red, green wedges hooked to it. On the front one here, uh, the same thing. The side one, same thing. And the, the one over here on the back side, the same thing. Um, that way I, I evenly try to evenly disperse um, the, the lights over on the hooks. I tried it with two hooks a couple years ago, but it was too much. It was just too much wire trying to go around those hooks, so I had to add, add the additional hooks. Okay. Okay, now that I have the outer layer of the tree off, I thought I'd show you the inside that I was telling you about. That's where the outer layer goes up to, and this is where the inside. So that's the medium tree, and the inside there, I'll take a shot of it once I get this off, is the inner tree. And just so you, in case you want to see, this is how I hook them on. And then up there, those are the hooks I use right there for the uh, outer layer. Okay. Uh, okay, lastly, here's the uh, very center tree that I was talking about. So you can see it goes about halfway up or so and then attach it down there. Okay, thanks for watching.